Hey guys, Chase here, and I have a bit of bad news. Uh, I went out to check my Carolina Reapers the other day, and I think someone dug through it. I think it was the raccoon. There's been a raccoon going around recently, and we've been trying our best to try and get rid of it, but I doubt it's ever going to happen. So, for now, I just really hope the other seeds that are in there are going to grow. Uh, I'm not sure, but I really hope so. Because I really want to do this challenge, and I really want to see peppers grow. Because there's a couple of other things I want to do with those peppers. And a couple of them involve homemade, uh, what was it called? Homemade barbecue sauce. Because I was planning on making spicy and sweet barbecue sauce using the Carolina Reapers. And with the way of what just happened, I'm not sure if they're going to grow now. I will keep checking on them and keep watering them, see if that will help. But for now, I just want to tell you guys that the Carolina Reapers seeds kind of got ruined. But on better news, if they do grow... I got a couple of people joining in with me. I got Ross the Salamander, so not 24, and I got Mark Lair 22 to join in this little project with me. Uh, I've decided to do, instead of waiting 10 minutes on when you eat it, you gotta wait 10 minutes. We're gonna put in our own little cake. We're gonna do it when it's at least cold. So we're thinking about either jumping into the lake or do something from there. I don't know. We're still trying to come up with a plan. The rest of the group has not joined in the conversation. So for now, I'm going to try and get a hold of them. Try and see what I can do about that. But I don't know what to do now. Like, what are we even going to do? If those don't grow now, I'm going to have to rebuy seeds and try and regrow them. That's all I can really do now. From the way it takes for them to go through their germination process, it takes up to three weeks to five weeks because they're spicy. And the spicier they are, the longer it's going to take. I let them wait for three weeks, finally got them to bud out, and planted them. That's all I could really do. So hope, hopefully soon, I should have a natural Carolina plant, and I'm going to have it grown like the way it should. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to do pesticides, or if I do, i got to find one that's more natural and not harmful to humans. So, one day I want to actually sell this as a product. That would be awesome for me. Uh, I can make homemade anything with them, really. Uh, I was planning on drying them out too, and turning them to a fine powder so I could make well, actually, that would be an easy way to make barbecue sauce. I don't know what other ways I'm going to do it. Like, we're still trying to figure out what to do with those Carolina Reapers. Like, what we want to do. Are we just going to eat the actual pepper? Are we going to put in something? We don't know. Uh, so, for now, I guess we just got to wait for them to grow. Uh, we had, I had five buds. Like five actual little plants growing, and now nothing. I'm still checking through them to see if any are growing, to see if they're all fine. But I don't know. On other news, I do have another plant I have. Wait, where did those seeds go? Oh no! Oh, I found them. Uh, if those Carolina Reapers don't grow, I might grow this fruit instead. Because this fruit I love, and it's not spicy at all. You guys should know what this fruit is. I don't know, but these are known as pomegranates. These were a great tasting fruit I've ever had before. All it is is the seeds you gotta eat. They're a little tangy, like a little bit tangy, but they're really delicious. I love them. But, for now, I just want to grow those Carolina Reapers. One of these days, when I get a different house, I will start growing these and maybe a couple other fruits because I really like some certain fruits. Like kiwi, 
pomegranates, and just a bunch of other things. But there was another thing I wanted to tell you. Uh, I don't know what day it was, but I hit 90 subscribers. I'm very excited for my channel to grow. I'm happy you guys love my videos. And once I get a job, I should be able to actually help you. Right now, I'm having money issues. And I'm also having trouble getting a job, too. It has something to do with my talent and all the jobs being taken up by, like, every kid. It's like not even kids from here, it's other kids from different towns that are taking jobs up here. So it's going to be harder for me to get a job. I'm trying my best to get one. Honestly, I want to take one that's based off of fabrication, but the ones I found are either in New York or in any other state. So there's nothing I can really do there but wait anyways. So for now, I'm trying to get a regular job so I can get enough money to move out of the state. Uh, hopefully, I I want to move out by maybe next year to two years. That's my goal, and I'm going to try and keep it. I'm going to keep it heads up with my friend Rasta and my friend Sanath and Marco. See what they want to do and have everything set up there. Uh, I don't know why my OSHA 10 is out. I'm not going to question that one, but... Yeah, I guess I will we'll check you guys later, and I just want to tell you that little update. So I'll see you guys later. Like, rate, and subscribe, and peace out, homies. I'll see you guys later.